Fast. Immersive. Stealthy. Adventure. Gadgets. Exciting. This is Cars 2. This is a different level. The inspiration for Cars 2 really sprang out of spy gadgets and this wonderful universe that Pixar has created. Great job, Mater. And the cast of characters that we've come to love so much. I'll let the fellas in. There are great moments in the movie that while the movie can only spend seconds or a few minutes on something, we can expand that into a much longer experience that's interactive. Now, one of the things we thought about was, well, where did Holly come from? We knew there was an agency, so we came up with this idea for Chrome. Welcome to the Chrome Training Academy. Chrome stands for, I don't know. I don't know the whole acronym, although I helped come up with it. Cars headquartered. Uh, espionage. Does anyone know what Chrome stands for? Chrome, the command headquarters for reconnaissance operations and motorized espionage. Welcome to Chrome's preparation simulation. It's the worldwide international spy organization of the good guys. Well done. They could all learn how to be a spy. They could all get equipped with really cool gadgets and weapons and, and play. There's a bunch of different aspects of being a spy. There's using weapons. There's evading attacks. There's going fast. I can play 22! It's more than just a race. It's kind of an obstacle course. You're still using the jumping, um, the two-wheel, the backward driving, all that stuff to avoid attacks, but you're also using weapons to try to blow up minions, other players, and also just wreak havoc in general. Oh, of course, and then there's probably the stuff that I shouldn't tell you about. The Cars 2 experience transcends what you would consider a normal racing game. It is an entire, authentic Cars universe experience. I know! I make this look simple! You get to be a spy, you get to race, you get to go different places around the world. When you play it, you're going to feel like, yeah, this is Cars, this feels right.